Britney Spears has receipts. The pop star posted, and promptly deleted, screenshots of text messages that she sent her mom, friend and lawyer after allegedly being forced into a mental health facility in 2019. It's a little different with proof, Spears, 40, wrote on Instagram early Monday. In the first screenshot, the toxic singer wrote to her mother, Lynn Spears, he was saying he wants to up the Sirocco, sick, and I'm like a horse he go fk yourself, sick. Sirocco I thought was a sleep aid but it's for bipolar and is way stronger than lithium. It is unclear whether Britney was referring to a doctor or her father, Jamie Spears, who controlled her medical care as her conservator. Seroquel, also known as quetiapine, is an antipsychotic medication that treats mood disorders including schizophrenia and bipolar disorder, according to WebMD. I literally feel all, sick, the sick medicine in my stomach, Brittany continued in her text to Lynn. I feel like he's trying to kill me. I swear to God I do. The Grammy winner claimed in her Instagram caption that she got no response from Lynn, 67, at the time, but she did hear from her mom when she checked out of the facility. Her words were you should have let me visit you and give you a hug, Brittany wrote. In the second screenshot, the Crossroads star asked her childhood friend Jansen Fitzgerald to help her find new counsel. When Britney's conservatorship began in 2008, a Los Angeles judge appointed a lawyer to represent her. She did not win the right to hire her own attorney until 2021. I need John Bell's number please, Brittany texted Fitzgerald in 2019. When you can. She then asked her friend about lithium, the mood stabilizing drug that Brittany told the court in 2021 made her feel drunk after her team allegedly changed her meds without her say. I have a feeling you will say I will be okay but it still doesn't make sense, Brittany texted Fitzgerald, claiming in her Instagram caption that she never heard back from her either. In the final screenshot, the oops, I did it again singer informed her court-appointed lawyer, Samuel D. Ingham III, that she wanted to make some changes in her life after being released from the facility. I want to talk about going to court when this is done and getting my medical rights," she wrote, adding that she wanted her conservatorship to end. When this program is over I don't want to work at all, I want to live for me and have an adventurous life," Brittany told Dingham. She concluded her Instagram caption by sharing a text that her sister, Jamie Lynn Spears, allegedly sent her around the same time, though Britney did not include a screenshot of that one. They are not gonna let you go so why are you fighting it, Jamie Lynn, 31, allegedly wrote.
Brittany claimed in her first ever public court speech last summer that her dad, Jamie, 70, sent her to the mental health facility against her will following a disagreement over her since cancelled Las Vegas residency domination. My dad and anyone involved in this conservatorship, and my management, who played a huge role in punishing me when I said no, ma'am, they should be in jail, she told the judge at the time. Jamie, who has denied any wrongdoing, was suspended as Britney's conservator last September, and the legal arrangement was terminated altogether that November. Lynn previously took partial credit for the conservatorship ending, arguing in court documents obtained by Page Six that the status quo would have continued if not for her relentless advocacy for her daughter. Page Six has reached out to Lynn's lawyer, Jamie Lynn's rep and Fitzgerald for comment.